I'm a documentary filmmaker who happens to live in Durango, who loves teaching, and connected Rocky Mountain PBS and Fort Lewis College. I met the wonderful Stacy Satoski, and uh, she was kind enough to invite me to co-teach with her. The Colorado Film Office gave her a grant to be able to have me come in. Our first film is about uranium, and it was assigned to us by Rocky Mountain PBS because they're doing a longer piece for their Colorado experience, their history strand, on uranium, but wanted some Southwest Colorado um, input on uranium since we were so much at the center of it. There was a smelter um, it, along the Adams River in the 80s. They tore it down and they cleaned up the site and moved the toxic material up to the hillside. We're wondering if there's any remnants, any hot spots, any radioactivity that still exists where the smelter was, which is now the dog park. This is going to be premiering at the Powerhouse Science Center on October 17th, coming right up. We wanted the students to be able to hit the ground running, so I took the liberty of writing a script that's a starting point. The students are excited that they'll be having a credit from Rocky Mountain PBS. We brought the class to the Center for Southwest Studies today because it's such a treasure trove of information and imagery. And we wanted the students to see the richness of what's right on their own campus. Right now we're learning the process of documentary filmmaking and uh, using archival content for the purposes of storytelling. I want my students to learn their capabilities and, and the higher purpose of creating media for social change that the community is curious about. So is there, is there uranium around us? Does it affect us? Um, we want to know, so we're going to find out.